but today we're going to do something called percutaneous coronary intervention or coronary angioplasty and so here's spider-man spider-man has a blockage in one of his coronary arteries that's, that's right we're gonna the heart man he could be heart man huh so we're going to be putting in a wire through the wrist and sometimes they go through the groin but we'll be going from the wrist all the way to the heart and from the heart we'll be able to open up the blockage in one of his coronary arteries and we're gonna just scrub around his wrist and that's the area we're gonna be going into and next we're gonna give a little numbing injection so that spider-man doesn't feel any pain <laughs> I did that, a lot. that was a lot so we're gonna put a needle and then a sheath and oh, we're going in through the you, radial artery. How did you put that there? I just made a little hole. We're gonna go from the radial artery to the brachial artery and then we're gonna go all the way over to the ascending aorta. So that'll be our entry so point. Mommy, what yes. is this a weird knife? Um, that's the mouthpiece to our nose, Frida. It's not sucker. Next, they usually inject a medication into there to stop the artery from clamping down. After that, we'll be putting in a wire in through the sheath. So we pushed the wire and a catheter or a thin tube up to the heart. We took pictures and this is what our coronary artery looks like. What's here? Fat. What is the... Um, I mean, yes. fat. It's fat and it's also called plaque. Doop -doop -doop. We're putting our wire through the plaque here. And over the wire, we're going to push a catheter with a balloon on the end. And then we're going to inflate the balloon. Well, it's coming out of the... <laughs> So you can see that when the balloon is inflated, it's squishing the plaque against the sides of the wall of the artery. So when we deflate it, the hole will actually be bigger than it was before. So this time we have a stent on the balloon. So you can see that the stent is left inside the artery to keep the artery open so it doesn't close back up again. And then we're going to pull the sheath out. And then we want to put a wristband onto his wrist. <laughs> and that's to hold pressure over the area so it doesn't bleed. And that's it, we did it.